morning friends i am dr ashish sarwal urologist and men's health expert from new delhi india in this video i will introduce to you mr sam he is from banara uganda and he is 64 years old and i did a robotic prostate surgery 2 weeks ago on him he was suffering from prostate cancer it was stage 1 prostate cancer psa was 15 rectal examination showed that it was only confined to the prostate we did scans which confirmed that the cancer was confined to the prostate so we decided to do robotic surgery in robotic surgery we remove the prostate and we remove the seminal vesicles and also the lymph nodes so everything in the pelvis was removed and we sent it for histopathology testing the surgery took about 2 hours after the surgery he was brought back to the room he was recovering well and today he is 2 weeks after the surgery we have removed the catheter he is able to contour his urine there is no urinary leakage and his biopsy has come he is cancer free so he is very happy and he is flying back tomorrow he just came here to give his experience about the whole treatment and how he feels now yes mr sam yes thank you so much and uh, so i'm from uganda africa and the uh, city of kwaito marara when i am a business people and we uh, have a club of business people and in that club we have a department of health so we test when we have a fund we post it uh is help and uh, and uh, on the bit himself to come to india for post surgery uh and we have a connection with dr sisi is the is the one who is you to be working with about the post surgery so now i have found we is posted and uh, the test is in uganda since we don't have that facility for for post surgery in hospital uh, robotic Uh, that's why I have come here to India. The process we have done. Uh, I'm now very happy. No pain, no stitches, and you know as many here about cancer in my life. You hear that it's death. That's what you can understand. But now, since it was removed, I feel very happy. I feel that I am still alive, and I am told and I know that I am now cancer free. So I thank the Lord. I thank for for the session that started. I thank the Tashishi and the hospitals in Delhi, especially the hospital that is working in. I am now a very happy person. I have no problems. I uh, feel very comfortable and happy. Uh, that's what I can say. So, fellow patients and friends, who oh, oh, you can test. Because for me, I was, I was not feeling any pain. But when I was tested, I found and found that I have prostate cancer. I have to care for my life. So there are so many patients who don't test. When we die, when you test for this, uh, another stage which is uh, for me I was in stage one, fifteen. PSA was fifteen. PSA was fifteen. Yeah. So if you are in stage two or three or four, I don't know what you are can happen. But since you went to stage stage one, uh, I'm told by Dr. Shishi that. Uh, and we be verify uh the rest will come uh and drop in the body uh if it to live for more time good good wish wishes thank you so much for friends and the and this has a good day with you and great you to care for your life thank you so much thank you mr sam for your interview and see he told a very important thing that everybody every male after an age of 50 especially the africans african americans they are high risk for prostate cancer and many times they will not be knowing that they have prostate cancer in their body so you should do your psa test it's a very simple blood test 2 ml of blood is drawn and from that you can do the psa and if the psa is high high means any psa more than 4 you should see with suspicion and should not ignore it and his psa was 15 so biopsy was done prostate biopsy showed that there was prostate cancer but still psa was not very high and we diagnosed it on time and that's why he is now cancer free so this is very important you have to be aware that prostate cancer is a disease which can affect any male above the age of 50 years especially the african and african americans have high risk for prostate cancer so if you are also a male after age of 50 you should do a psa and if it is high you should consult your urologist and he will guide you if your prostate cancer is diagnosed remember that if it's diagnosed at a stage 1 or 2 robotic surgery can fully cure it with very good outcomes you don't have to worry too much about the urinary leakage we do special surgery in which nerve sparing surgery is done and we put the amniotic graft so that the urine control gets back quickly 
So if you are diagnosed at a correct stage, then we can do excellent surgery and give you excellent results. So friends, with this, I hope you liked our interview with Mr. Sam from Uganda. And if you or your family is suffering from prostate cancer and you want to contact me, you can contact me on email or WhatsApp. My email address and WhatsApp number are given in the description. Thank you. Thank you, Sam. Yeah.